Boss, please don't go charging ahead. You're an <laughs> omi, not some hunting dog. Don't worry. She has a point. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <sighs> Looks pretty deep. Be careful, Man. Ito is literally making this um, quest more entertaining than it's supposed to. Check out G2A.com for the best deals in games, peripherals, and also gift cards, and more. Check out the link in the video description. Also, if you're new here to the channel, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you guys can get notified on my latest videos. Hey, what is up guys? This is Wild One, and welcome back here to my YouTube channel and we are now back here to Genshin Impact. So yep, we're back here once again and this time we are here in the Chasm. Um, apparently, we are trying to make our way to the new quest. Apparently, this is already the patch 2.7. They just released this um, apparently a few days ago. So yep, we are now currently doing this Archon quest called... Um, Per Perilous Trail, so Interlude Chapter Act 2, so uh, right now we are here in the lower parts of the chasm, or should I say pretty much underneath the chasm itself, so we just need to get right here, apparently we are pretty much near, I didn't want to really just teleport my way here since, well pretty much there are a lot of things scattered right here that, that are, well pretty much useful like other, some chest and with much some other resources but anyways we are already here so yeah no need for teleporting though um man oh wait someone is here I guess that's Yan oh, Fei. Traveler yep. and Paimon? It is. I didn't expect to see you two here. Yan Fei? Shouldn't you be at work in Lele Harbor? What are you doing out in the middle of nowhere? Well, to be perfectly honest, this case is a little out of the ordinary. In fact, this is the first time I've ever witnessed the bottom of the chasm. Oh, but before I forget, could you do me a favor, please? If anyone happens to ask about me or my present whereabouts, just tell them you haven't seen me. Huh? Um, Roger. What are you talking about? <laughs> um, did you do something no, no, illegal? Like that. Uh, look, it's quite a long story. So if you could, please just cover for me. I'll see you later. So she's pretty much just down here exploring. Something illegal, and now she's gone into hiding here. <gasps> or maybe something super scary happened. Don't she's a legal advisor. The world is complicated these days, you know. We should be prepared for the worst. If something really did Honestly, happen, Honestly, I guess Paimon is currently correct here. Oh, what a dilemma. Should we really Makes sense. Her? Um, you're the one that's both naive and complicated. Hey, it's Ito. Hey, you over there? Yeah, you. We have one new character as well. I believe this one is on the <laughs> weapon banner right now. Oh wait, no. I believe the Your one that is right now on the banner is currently Yilan. This girl is literally different though. <laughs> it's you two. So, uh, what are you two doing in a place like this, huh? Wait, don't tell me. Hmm, you're on vacation. It's the one and only say, Ito. You two are looking pretty good. Things been going your way lately? Cuz I have been doing amazing. <laughs> uh, Ito? Who's that behind you? Hey there. I'm with the Arataki gang. Kuki Shinobu. Nice to meet you. Kuki Shinobu. Oh, <laughs> all right. I almost forgot she was back there. Let me introduce you to Shinobu, the pride and joy of the Arataki gang. Another member of Ito's gang! Let me tell you, she's one of Hanamizaka's best and brightest, so of course she's in the gang. Shinobu takes care of practically everything in the Arataki gang. She can protect you guys too, you know? A friend of the boss is a friend of mine. You must be the traveler in Paimon. Yep, yep! Nice to meet you too, Shinobu! Uh, 
Shinobu. The pleasure's mine. Nice to meet you. I have a feeling that we'll be working together soon enough. So, uh, Ito, if she's the one that takes care of everything in the gang, then doesn't that kind of make her the gang's real boss? <laughs> Are you kidding? <laughs> of course not. Hey. I'm the boss. To the four corners of the vat, Bye, man. one boss of Hanamizaka. <laughs> She's speaking facts, though. Hockey gang, a me. Uh, okay, Paimon gets the dynamic now. A useless boss with an ultra capable subordinate. Hey, you, uh, you know what? Forget it. She's speaking the facts. <laughs> couldn't possibly understand the dynamics of the Arataki gang. As the leader, I can't let myself stoop down to your level. <clears throat> anyway, have you seen a pink-haired legal, uh, mage lady? Wears a goofy hat, knows everything, kind of short. Does he know Yan Fei or something? Uh-oh. Her name's Yan Fei. She's a legal advisor from Li Yue. Hmm. I thought perhaps you two would know her. Oh, yep, we no. know her all right. We haven't seen her. We don't know this person at all. <laughs> <laughs> Let it slip the moment you said, oh, oh. <laughs> uh, so you have seen her. Uh, no, what gave you that idea? Paimon didn't say anything. Aw, <laughs> oh, look at you getting all antsy. <laughs> Seems I was able to get to the truth after all. When someone is lying, their eyes often start wandering subconsciously. Well, um, they caught us. <laughs> anyway, don't worry. Well, Paimon sure was actually caught. Intentions. So, uh, you guys know Yanfei? Well, she, uh, kind of saved my life, so... Yeah, you could say we've met. She saved your life? Wait, hold on. What are you two doing in the chasm anyway? I'm not going to be too slow. has been lifted recently in Inazuma, right? Well, Shinobu wanted to come to Liyue and pick up her graduation certificate. I came along because it's safer to travel in numbers. Graduation certificate? Did you study in Liyue? Yes. I studied law at the Tongwen Academy in Liyue. Unfortunately, the Sakoku Decree was implemented just when I was home visiting my family before graduation. So I'm a few years late getting my graduation certificate. We were taking care of some errands in Liyue, and the boss got tangled up with some millilith while we were standing in a line. He was about to get arrested when, luckily, Yenfei uh, happened as to be expected walking past helped us out. Ito. Yep, if it wasn't for her, our trip to Liyue would have ended with me and the slammer. <laughs> what the hell did he so, you just know, do though? I just wanted to do something nice to show my heartfelt gratitude. But she said she didn't need my help with anything. I thought there's a chance she might run into trouble here on her own, so I followed her here. Yeah, just in case she needs me to come leaping to her rescue. <laughs> so you're forcing her to accept your what? help? No, it's not like that at all. Look, I, I just wanted to protect her, okay? She looked like she was in a hurry, so I thought she must be out doing something important. People can get into trouble when they're out in the world dealing with serious business, you know? I'm, I'm just being considerate, really. <clears throat> Traveler. Mm -hmm. Um. Distract Ito. Ah, yes, they went that way. Ah, great. Thanks. I'll go after her. Shinobu, time to roll. Fear not, my savior. Ito's coming to your rescue! <laughs> Appreciate the help. Until next time. Uh, Traveler, did you just send Ito the wrong way on purpose? Huh. <laughs> Shinobu seemed pretty sharp. Paimon doesn't think you can pull one on her like that. Or maybe she knows that Ito can be a big nuisance, so she's trying to stop him from bothering Yanfei. Oh, if that's the case, then wow, she really knows how to call the shots. Well, at least this way nobody will be bothering Yamfei. If we run into her again later, we should let her know that we helped her out. Hmm. All right. Now let's go take a look at the crash site from last time. Yeah, apparently the last time of the crash site that I'm talking about is apparently the one that we currently did. Um, apparently I currently did that. Um. World quest apparently um, not recording. Well, obviously, since it's a world quest, I didn't really expect it to be part of this quest, though. Um, so, should I really go down? Like, literally more deeper? 
Um, I'm, I'm guessing that's what I should do. Apparently, right now, I'm using Noel as a DPS for now, since, um, why not? I am currently experimenting with her build right now. Um, okay, Yanfei is here. Good. Thanks a lot. The guy with the weird outfit seemed super outgoing. Normally, I don't mind making friends, but I've got work to do today. What kind of work? Oh, so what kind of work are you doing in a place like this? Aw, oh, don't tell Paimon you're thinking about becoming an adventurer too. Well, as a legal advisor, sometimes I also have to travel in person. I came to the chasm to deal with a will. A will? Uh, a will? That's right. I found a will inside an old book. I'm guessing it was left by someone of great importance. It appears he lost a magical device and wished to retrieve it. Paimon didn't magical know what the? have to deal with that kind of thing. Huh, what a job! Will execution is also part of my work as a legal advisor. Of course, cases like this are quite rare. The chasm is not the kind of place you can just waltz into whenever you want. Oh? So you do know what kind of place this is. Hmm? Who's that? Oh, is, I thought I might find you here. Is this the new character right now? That is on the banner. Ah, uh, yes, it's Yilan. Oh, was that really her plunge attack? Whatever case you're working on in the Nice. Garden, I'm sure Liyue's top legal consultant can handle it without my input. <laughs> That's funny. I thought we'd establish that my legal opinion doesn't count for anything when Yelon's around. Uh, who is she? This is Yelon. Leo is, uh... Well, let's just say she works in the Ministry of Civil Affairs. I can at least say that much, right? Anyway, she's a friend of mine. Sure. Coincidentally, I have something to do here as well. Seems chance has brought us all together. You may not know me, Traveler in Paimon, but I've certainly heard about you. Um, guess I have so many friends in Liyue. It's my job to monitor the chasm. According to regulations, I should accompany you. But, as it turns out, I have other things that require my attention. I'm afraid I can't join you this time. You may go about your business. Just try not to make a ruckus. Oh, that's most unfortunate. I was about to ask for your assistance. Could you spare a little time to help me take care of this will? For old time's sake? Hmm, I don't know. Depends what's in it for me. <laughs> Fair enough. I suppose even a guide needs to get paid. It just so happens that Madame Ping gave me some nice tea. I'll treat you to a cup if you agree. <laughs> Why don't you tell me a little more about how you got here first? Then I'll... Hey, you! Oh, it's Ito. Uh, Ito? What is he doing back here? I know what you two did. You really tried to throw me off, didn't you? <laughs> and I thought, oh, man. But... Well, they're also my friends, so... That's close enough. Huh? Who are you? Sorry, this area is part of the chasm. It's closed to the general public. Are you kidding me? I, I I don't see any warning signs or fences. What gives you the right to keep me out? Kid, where there's real danger, you'll never see a warning sign. Uh, Paimon never knew this place was so important. Um, it really is it's an true. unusual place. This is not a place you can just go in and out of as you wish. That's also why I didn't want anyone to follow me. Unfortunately, you didn't listen. The Traveler has done a lot for Liyue in the past. And Yenfei is a renowned legal consultant in Liyue, so I can trust their intentions. As for you two... <laughs> well... Hey, what's that supposed to mean? You're trying to say that I'm not famous enough and my intentions are no good? I don't know <laughs> your background, so I can't give you free passage here. Besides, Yenfei doesn't seem to need your help, does she? How would you know what Yenfei needs? What are you two joined at the hip or something? Right. Bruh, you're talking too much. Anyway, I don't need to be a mind reader to see that. 
In any case, as a visitor from Inazuma, I'd suggest you defer to a local when in doubt. Stick to the local rules and keep yourself out of trouble. <coughs> Why, you? Chill, man. Try not to be so impulsive. She is right, you know. Uh-oh. Things are starting to get a little heated here. Oh, not good. He really shouldn't start butting heads with Yelon. It's true that we don't know anything about the unique conditions of this place. So we'll heed your advice and leave immediately. But if this really is a dangerous area, seriously, you should put up a sign. Thanks for the suggestion. I'll consider it. Oh yeah? And what if we don't leave? Well, Shinobu is, um, but has a point though. Then, I'm afraid things might We don't get need a sign right unpleasant. here. <laughs> is that so? You really think you can take the two of us? <laughs> Gotta admit, I like your optimism. Although you're friends with the Traveler and Yenfei, I'd still suggest you heed my warning. <laughs> Thanks for that, but uh, too bad I'm not buying it. If you're so strong, then why don't you show me what you got? Bro, chill. Don't fight right here. Hold on, boss. There's no need to start a fight here. Oh no, I'm going in whether she likes it or not. <laughs> you think I was joking around, huh? Oh no. Oh no, these two are about to go at it! Um... Please, wait a minute, you two. This whole thing started because of me. Why don't you just save me the embarrassment? Ground is shaking. Just... Uh -oh. Earthquake? Uh... Hey, stop trying to change the subject. I'm gonna... Uh, uh, uh huh? Uh, 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 uh. Oh shoot! <laughs> He literally fell down first. <laughs> really? He's the one that literally fell down first, I guess. The one that who is more noisy is the one that's going to die first. Ooh. Ouch. What happened? Uh, oh, hey, are you alright? I'm fine. my books under me to break the fall didn't help at all <sighs> this place where are we a bottomless pit uh, i'm gonna feel that in the morning uh, hey shinobu traveler and my savior is everyone okay <laughs> it might oh, save this you. This is an unfortunate turn of events. Hey, so, uh, how far down did we fall? Hmm. It seems the ground collapsed during our little confrontation up there. Perhaps because we triggered the elemental forces. Well, don't look at me. If you weren't so rude, maybe I wouldn't have gotten mad. <sighs> Who can put up with that kind of dude? It's my duty to stop intruders from breaking into important places. If telling the truth sounds rude, then I'm afraid you're just a little too fragile. Hey, life's too short to give in all the time. Boss, I'm afraid you're not going to win this argument. I suggest we stop provoking her. Hey, yeah, just listen to her. You? Chill, Ito. I'm simply pointing out the facts. I understand how you feel. But you're making my life difficult by starting random fights with everyone. <laughs> Looks like Ito can't argue against either Yeon or Shinobu. He's in a real tough spot now. So Ito and Shinobu are kind of like you and me. <laughs> hey! What do you mean? Don't you dare compare Paimon to Ito! Whoa, whoa! What do you mean? You looking for a fight too? <laughs> Paimon was just saying how it is! Everyone knows you're a bit of an idiot! You call me an <laughs> idiot? Oh yeah? Well you're a, a puny little flying lavender melon, ha! Flying lavender melon? Oh, oh man. Mad. Time to give you an ugly nickname! Uh, bull chucker! You better mind your manners, bull chucker! We seem to be a long way down from man. It's Would you look at that? They are, they, the they are still arguing <laughs> in the background. We'll climb back up that far. We'll need to find another way. I'm sorry to interrupt your lovely little chat here, but I think there's something you may need to know. 
The chasm is regarded as a mysterious area in Liyue. It was sealed off for years due to a mining accident. Whatever goes on down here, I suggest you remember this. You didn't see anything, you didn't hear anything, and you're not gonna ask any questions. Save you from getting caught up in things you shouldn't know about. I won't treat you as hostiles, and in exchange, I hope you won't make things difficult when it comes to keeping secrets. I'll do what I can to find a way out. Huh? Well, where does she think she's going? Like she said, to search for an exit. Chances mm. are that Yelan is the best among us at survival and handling emergencies. We should just let her go. I'm afraid I must apologize. I don't typically disclose details of a client's will to third parties, which is why I couldn't tell you the truth. I'm sorry. I came to the chasm in search of the Fantastic Compass, which is mentioned in the will. Many years ago, my client gave this magical device to someone ambitious, hoping that it'd be handy in times of need. According to an eyewitness account, the person who received the device took it into the chasm and has been missing ever since. Throughout history, many wars have been fought in the vicinity of the chasm. Even if that person died in one of the wars, I still wish to do my utmost and find the device and fulfill the client's wish. Yelan's words of caution were not unwarranted. There are dangers lurking in the chasm. I'm sure you've all realized that by now. Given that we're all caught in this mess, let's try to find a way out together. Whatever you say, my savior, I'll do whatever you ask. From now on, we're a team, all of us. And as for that big jerk, well, hmm, I guess that includes her too. <laughs> Yelan uh... works for the Ministry of Civil Affairs, huh? Paimon can tell she's tougher than most, but wow, her job sounds demanding. Well, that's what she tells outsiders. I can't disclose too much about her identity, but I'd say she's the only person who can handle this type of work. What kind of lame job would have someone go out to the middle of nowhere? Oh, Paimon knows! An adventurer! <laughs> Man, hey, really? What's with the face? Oh, did Paimon say something wrong? Man, that face I reaction made it better. Too, isn't it? <laughs> I'm the adventurer, Paimon, not you. <laughs> You're so stingy these days. Oh, just let Paimon be an adventurer by association, okay? Yeah, she's got a point, Traveler. You're Paimon's boss. Take it from me. As a great leader, you should learn to be a little more generous. You know, let your sidekick share some of the glory Ugh, you really don't understand anything about us paimon don't take him too seriously he's just joking Ugh, for the sake of shinobu fine <laughs> i'm the boss so i'll let it slide hmm. perhaps this was another sealed location but an undocumented one what could be in here I've got some food and water on me. If anyone needs some, just let me know. Great! You know, Bull Checker, you may not be the sharpest tool in the shed, but your subordinate here seems super capable and reliable. <laughs> I know. Isn't she the best? What? Hey, I am too a sharp tool! There seems to be an entrance up ahead, with a path inside. Wonder where it leads to? Well, let's go take a look. Okay, time to get exploring. Someone needs assistance. Okay, apparently there's nothing much really here. Okay, that is a portal. A portal to where? Who would have guessed we'd find a domain entrance in a place like this? If there's a way in, then there's a way out. Let's go and take a look. The rocks here seem to be old Liyue mountain rocks. They're similar to what I've seen in books. This domain must have existed for quite some time now. <laughs> What's that sound? <sighs> um. <laughs> oh. oh. It's Xiao. Conqueror of demons. What are you doing here? 
Oh, uh, I came down from above. Uh, I heard a noise, so I followed it here. So you're not here by accident. Hmm. Wanna team up? No, I have something else to do. Is it something I'm important? for someone. You shouldn't be here. I would urge you to go back as soon as possible. Well, well that's show you just for you. went. Shows up without a warning and disappears without a trace. Huh, that guy looked pretty tough. Maybe almost as tough as me. Seems like a solid dude. <laughs> Seriously, bull checker? Where do you get your confidence from? Should we really be letting him go off on his own? Oh, he wouldn't listen no matter how much you tried to talk him out of it. He is super tough though, so don't worry about him. Everyone, keep your eyes and ears peeled from here on out. We don't know what lies ahead, so we have to be ready for anything. Roger, Roger. Oh, look, I'm happy to say we're all on the same team and everything, but uh, could you cut the little speeches and the whole follow the leader act? I, for one, think I should be able to look after myself. Boss! <laughs> really? Here okay. we go again. Okay. Besides, Yelan is just looking out for everyone. You know, Bullchucker, you're a guest here, so maybe try to get along with everyone. Ha! Please, you're not a local either, Flying Lavender Melon. So stop trying to sound like one. Um, we're going through it? Yes, we're going through it. Start. Yep, let's just start. I think we'll be fine though. Um, man, it is a domain. Um, where do I go from here? Okay, so there's a... Wait. Okay. Labyrinths like this are unique to Liyue. This place is actually pretty cool. If we weren't in such a hurry okay, to get so out, that worked. we could kick back and enjoy the scenery a little. Right here. I'm always watching. Emerge. Right here. Mm -hmm. Someone needs assistance. <gasps> Apparently, that literally All took them out. Turns <laughs> the Man, that looks cool. Could there be an here? Apparently, that's not really that cool. Apparently, it morally looks um odd or pretty much out of place. It it seems janky. If you guys know what I mean. Emerge right now. I'll catch up. Emerge right now. Fate is upon you. Let me scrub. Okay, that was easy. Hmm. Apparently, I'm just going to change something real quick right here. Yeah, let's just get this. Just in case if we currently died or pretty much need some quick health if you guys know what i mean um okay so apparently we have turned that already Someone needs assistance. and i believe we need to flip it i guess we need to flip it honestly i'm not really sure okay that is apparently blocked hold on i'm pretty sure i can find out a way right here really no Oh wait, so that means this is literally a freaking puzzle. Well, honestly, I hate puzzles. <laughs> um, hold on. Is there any way to get back to the other one? That is a negatory. Hmm. So obviously, we cannot go through that. Okay, so we can go through here. And we just need to flip this. But the problem is, I guess if we flip it, we cannot get to it. We can't get to it, can we? Oh wait, we can. That's good. Oh. Mm-hmm. 
a dutiful maiden. Right now. Emerge. Let me scrub. I must leave no stone unturned. Well, that's done. We just need to flip this right there. Well, not really fl flip it, more like rotate. Mm -hmm. And this is empty. Oh, wait, never mind. Right it just here. took them a while to load. Okay, ow. gonna do that and that and come on some physical attacks ow I'm getting pushed right here okay that's challenge completed and we have a chest nice okay so we're going through And we're back to the chasm. Wh huh? Wait, this ain't right. Uh, uh how did we end up it just here? brought back us. So we've been here already? Yes, this is exactly where we started. Yeah, but literally brought we couldn't have back taken us a wrong here. Turn. We were headed in the same direction the entire time. We never turned around. Yes, that's what I thought too. Traveler, we were going the right way, weren't we? Um, I thought we were headed in the right direction. How strange. Or probably it's a literally a replica. A who was tricked by a Bake Danuki one evening and kept circling around the same place the whole night. Even by dawn, they still hadn't found a way out. Yeah, Pylons heard that one before too. So we're all familiar with the story then? Good, because I'm pretty sure that's what's happening to us right now. But fear not, I happen to have a certain sidekick <laughs> who can exercise yokai Here and he goes again. And whatnot. Let me summon him real quick. Unbelievable. An Oni who's friends with an exorcist? Huh. What an open-minded guy. For the boss, ignorance is a virtue. You're up, Ushi. Go get this dude. Mm-hmm. Oh. This is Ushi, an auxiliary member of the Arataki gang. Man, that actually, <laughs> that shot looks so good. Mm. I can literally use that for a uh, hello, thumbnail. You can just call him Ushi or Beefcake. Yeah, he's got a keen sense of direction, so I'll let him lead the way. <laughs> I didn't know gangs could have auxiliary members. This does not have the trappings of something that's going to work. <laughs> You're telling me. All right, go Ushi. Go find us a way out of here. Miss. Huh? What's that? Oh, really? Oh, no way. What's wrong? Ushi says he searched everywhere, but there's no exit. That doesn't add up. If we were able to come in, then there must be a way to get out. Here, let me take another look. Has uh -huh. anyone else noticed this? We initially thought we fell here from above. At that time, there was a way out high overhead. But now, it seems even that exit has disappeared. Inexplicable, if you ask me. So, pretty much we're in a replica cave something. Hmm. I'm gonna take another look around. <laughs> There are just more and more rocks. Uh, maybe we've just misremembered. Maybe this isn't the place we started from. What? You scared now? No. Paimon's super brave. Oh, yeah? Well, uh, Ushi also thinks you're scared. It's okay. Don't be scared to admit you're, uh, <laughs> scared. You've got us here to protect you. I'm here for we you to buy money. You're twiddling our thumbs. Let's keep looking for a way out. Shinobu, you stay here with my precious savior. I'll take the traveler 
and Paimon with me. <laughs> Got it. Be careful, every please. There's no need to keep calling me savior. Just <laughs> Yenfei is fine. Yeah. Mr. Arataki, Just change that. it seems that as the head of the Arataki gang, you possess a strong sense of leadership. Ah, too kind, too kind. And just call me Ito. Since we're a team now, we should have each other's backs. Uh, Paimon, if you feel scared again, I can cover your eyes for you. <sighs> Seems there's really no way out. <sighs> I can't shake the feeling that there's something off about this place. Boss, did you guys find anything over there? Not only that, I could have sworn I saw some shadows moving a second ago. <sighs> this place better not be haunted. <laughs> not Afraid of ghosts, fast, man. But Paimon just can't help it. Ito, you're an Oni. Doesn't that kind of mean everywhere you go is haunted? Uh, no, ignore the red horns, okay? I I'm talking about spooky, floaty ghosts. Now you see and now you <laughs> don't kind of haunted. Uh, Ito, are you afraid of ghosts? Looks oh, like it. Boss, you've been found out. What? Me? <laughs> no way. What? Are you kidding? <sighs> Stop choking around. <sighs> Seriously, though. <laughs> Looking at you, Paimon suddenly doesn't feel scared anymore. Hey, Bullchucker, if you're scared, Paimon can cover your eyes for you. <laughs> <sighs> Here we go Maybe again. I make better use of my time. Add a little salt and some pepper. Roasting lavender yeah, melons. Roasted lavender melon is delicious. You can try some when it's done. All oh, right. There are two types: sweet and savory. Which would you prefer? Happy with either. All right. You can try them both then. It's important that we remain calm. Especially when we're in the throes of a tough situation like this. If I'm reading the situation correctly, there seems to be some secret here that the boss and I are not supposed to know about. But don't worry. I'll distract the boss while you discuss things with the others. Oh, I thought I smelled something cooking. Would you like some, Yunfei? Thank you, but I'm not hungry. You guys go ahead. Oh, and by the way, I haven't seen you in a while, Shinobu. Yeah, it has been a while, hasn't it? The last time I saw you was when you taught one of my classes as a substitute while I was studying in Liyue. Substitute teacher? Ah, yes, now I remember. It was during winter, wasn't it? Yes, I remember everyone said your lecture was very interesting. Now that I think about it, I should call you senpai. Ooh, I like the sound of that. <laughs> <sighs> Who would have ever guessed that we'd get caught up in such a dilemma together? It must be fate. Ryanve gives lectures too. Not only that, she's funny and engaging while she speaks. Needless to say, she's very popular among the students. <laughs> oh, I'm flattered. <sighs> I see everyone is still here. Yelon, we split into groups and searched the area, but there are no signs of any way out. How about you? Did you manage to find anything? No. And, though I'd prefer not to say it, we'd better mentally prepare ourselves. If we can't find a way out, we may be stuck underground for some time. <sighs> I think you might be right. I understand. Hmm. An underground space with an entrance but no exit. It just doesn't make any sense. I'll figure something out. Just give me some time. If anyone happens to find a potential exit, please be sure to take every precaution before exploring further. I'm to think of it, Joe is here too. He said we can always call his name. Maybe it's worth a try. Hey, traveler, what's with the serious face? Do you have a plan? I was thinking that Joe is also yeah. here. Oh, right. <laughs> Worth a try. Give it a shot. Huh. Huh. No response. Paimon thought Shell would come no matter where we are. Oh no, does that mean even Shell can't sense our presence here? 
or he's behind us, mysteriously. No, it would literally be better if we can literally hear uh, um, the traveler. Hmm. Pretty much we have to talk to everyone right now. So yeah, pretty much um, we're still stuck here. So looks like we just really have to do nothing That's but literally just talk to each member. Time, I, Arataki, uh, the one and only, will... Boss! <laughs> whoa, whoa, what's up, Sourpuss? Time for some roasted lavender melon. Huh? We're trapped in a life and death situation underground and... You're telling me it's time for roasted lavender melon? <laughs> Interesting. You hear that? Ushi says you're completely right. Wait, hold on. Whose side are you on, Beefcake? It's important to stay replenished. We must keep our energy and morale up in preparation for facing the unknown. Even Ushi knows that. Fine. You two are... Hey, are you already eating? Well, hold on. Is it still warm? <laughs> Oh, oh, that does smell good. <laughs> Fine. Yeah, yeah. We'll we'll just we'll have a quick snack and then we'll uh, and then we'll keep looking for a way out. Hey, don't eat them all. Leave a couple for me. Ito is literally the comedian right now here in this gang. Hmm. Who could have ever guessed we'd get trapped in a place like this? It's quite the predicament. For all the studying I've done in my life, all I know is how to land people in prison. I don't know the first thing about breaking out of one. I've even made a contract with my father to live a happy life. I can't give up hope now. Try and stay positive. At least I've explored a new place and seen more of the world while reuniting with some old friends. <laughs> yeah, there's still a silver lining, I guess. Uh-huh. Let's talk to Yilan. Our situation is grim. <laughs> there doesn't appear to be a way out for now. We should be prepared to stay for a while. Fortunately, we don't seem to lack supplies. And even our motley crew has people who can keep their cool when the stakes are high. Just focus on taking care of yourselves. I'll figure out the rest. Raja Daja. Oh! Teleport waypoint unlock. I'm interact with a mysterious wooden board. Which wooden board? Hold on, I do not even see a freaking wooden board. Oh! So it's literally this one. Um. Apparently, these are literally challenges. Um. Hmm. Wait till the next day. <laughs> you, are, you, are you really not kidding me right now? Hmm? Really? Wait for the next day? Um, I'm guessing this will work as well. I'm guessing it will work. Yep, that worked. You mean fly? Oh, all right, fly free then. Basically, Paimon just went out of here. Just like that, a whole day has gone by. Day? No, it feels like we've been down here for months. Uh, maybe not months, but at least like twenty days, surely. Yo, yo! Thought I heard you chatting over here. Oh, hey, Bullchucker. Well, everyone, I just completed another survey of the surrounding area. Still nothing has changed today. Here, have some water and take a rest. Thank you, Shinobu. <sighs> it's easy to forget to keep hydrated down here. Ugh, out! I want out! All I want is to cruise the streets and have beetle fights again. <laughs> Boss, remember there's your image to consider. But it's so boring. Walking around this hole every day, I, if only I could slurp some ramen and... See the beautiful flowers again. Ramen? Wait a minute. Speaking of ramen, Traveler, are you hungry? 
not really. I'm not hungry either. But let me pose the question this way. Who is the biggest eater among us? It's definitely not me. Hey, what's everybody looking at me for? Well, it's definitely <laughs> yep, it's not though. me. If anyone, it's this one right here. Huh? What are you looking at Paimon for? Paimon, mm -hmm. are you hungry? Um, no. Paimon's not hungry. Why do you ask? <sighs> if that's the case... What's huh? the matter, though? What, 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 what am I missing here? 20 days. Yeah, I heard that too, as I was walking over. The question is, how can you not feel hungry, even after 20 days? And I feel like it's only been for That's one day. so strange. Of course, everyone has different perceptions of the passage of time. But how could one person feel like it's only been one day and someone else 20 days? Yeah, now that you mention it, I feel like we've been here three, four, five days, but I don't feel hungry or thirsty at all. Although I cooked some food, it wasn't because I was hungry. I just wanted to keep our spirits up. I was planning on saving our rations so we could survive a few more days. But I haven't really felt hungry since. Now that I think about it, not only am I not hungry, but I don't feel any real signs of fatigue either. Whether I sleep or not doesn't seem to have any effect on how I feel. Yes, I concur. Resting doesn't make me feel more refreshed, and staying awake doesn't make me any more tired. Very peculiar. It's almost as if our physical state has been suspended. Oh, the more you say, the scarier it sounds. Paimon doesn't even want to think about it. Huh? What's wrong, Traveler? Did you think of something? Mm hmm. That's pretty weird. Sounds like the little dude must be in danger. But he is an adeptus. This kind of situation should be no trouble for him. I fear that this problem underground is bigger than we thought. I found something, everyone. I just discovered a new path over there that seems to lead to an unknown area. You mean a way out? Oh, finally! Let's go have a look. I still suspect things can't be that simple. We should all stay prepared for whatever comes. Huh? Paimon doesn't see anything out of the ordinary here. Appearances um, same see. here. As I was examining the wall just now, I noticed there was something unusual about this stone. Seems to me that it's been created using some illusory magic. Hidden behind it lies a passageway. A passageway? Oh, so there really is a passageway right oh. here. Had to hand it to you. That sure wasn't easy to find. But at least we can finally get out of here. Miss Yelon's determination and eye for detail are certainly impressive. Not to mention, you've hardly had any rest the whole time we've been trapped here. It doesn't matter. I'm not tired. <sighs> well, given we're already here, we might as well go in and explore. Right behind you. Paimon can't wait to get out of this place. Well, continue exploring. Um. Oh, man, we have another portal right here. Okay, let us start. Hmm. About symbols. Symbols of the platform will have different colors and images. Hmm. How do I use it though? Someone needs assistance. Oh shoot. Man, um I, I feel dizzy. Is that you? Hey, oh. did anyone else just hear that voice? It sounded super creepy. Yes it does. Oh what? Huh? I don't get this. I don't get this at all. What hit me? Don't fight you. Is some sort of battle what taking place? What the hell? Here? I wonder who could be involved. 
I don't even know what's going on or what am I supposed to touch or do. <coughs> Fifteen minutes later. Oh, it's puzzle. Uh, I missed a spot. Ow. Steady as stone. Okay, now I get it. Right now, emerge. Okay. We got this. Man! I was literally wondering what the hell am I supposed to do? So apparently I just literally need to step on all of these things. Uh, just so I can activate like this current kind of battle right here. Okay, just break their shields. Apparently their shields are still tough though. I got that one. Okay. Control the positions of the beam light. Really? Bro, this is literally hard. Well, not really, but you guys know what I mean, right? Okay. So that one's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We keep on rolling. I gotta say to Hoyovers though that um, um, they literally took their time for this patch. Like, this is literally good. Okay, we're going to the next one. Isn't green supposed to be dendro? Apparently, we still do not have any of those. So, um, let's just keep on uh, stepping on all of this. Until everything apparently lights up. Okay. And that worked. Emerge right now. Let me scrub. As a good night should. Leave it all to me. Alright. Come on. Right here. Emerge. Right I'm gonna now. use this. Burst. Another burst. Right here. I must leave no stone unturned. What a nuisance. You can't run. Okay, apparently I got that one. Well, we're going to continue um doing this. So yeah, this will apparently take some time. A little longer than a few minutes later. Okay, that is activated. Ow. Apparently you literally just walk on top of them. Someone needs right now. How? Steady as stone. Decided by destiny. Shadows of the emerge right now. Emerge. Mm -hmm. As a good night should. <laughs> okay, got him. Great. Um, some more thingies to do. Okay, we got that one. Okay. Um, hopefully that's the last one. Oh wait, I still have to um, do the hydro one. 
Okay, we're almost there. We're almost there. This is literally dizzy. This is literally making me dizzy. I must leave no mm -hmm. Continue stepping on them. Just activate whatever needs to be activated. Whatever. Ow. Okay. That's good. Just gonna do this. Put that there. Ow. Ow. That... That literally hurt. Die, die, I need some help. I need some help. I need some help from you guys. Oops! Wrong character. <laughs> I was supposed to use Mona, but I currently use the um, Yai instead. Well, that still worked though, so not really much of a big problem. Okay. Um. Whoa. Okay. So I'm guessing we just do this. Yep. And same for this. There you go. And that should be activated. Yo, look at that animation. The light seems to be leading to another platform. Let's go and take a look. Mm hmm This seems us though. Just a random hole. called Shao down there? We gotta help him. Hold on. Something's not right here. What's this? It appears to be a small fissure. What can you possibly find inside? It can't be a living person, can it? <laughs> oh, it's Shao. Conqueror of demons? Shao, is that you? <sighs> oh, and quit trying to scare us, okay? Huh? Wait, is this some kind of illusion? Paimon can't touch him! Conqueror of Demons, can you hear us? Um, the hell happened? Oh, little dude! Anyone home? He isn't responding. What's going on here? You. Oh, he finally said something! Oh! We followed your voice and found you here, but it's kind of strange. We can't touch you. How did you become an illusion? <sighs> an illusion? Talk about a coincidence. We were just thinking you went missing and stuff, and, and then we heard the sound of you fighting. Pretty lucky we found you, if you ask me. <laughs> you didn't get hurt, did you? A coincidence? Wait. Something's not right. <laughs> Something's wrong with this domain. Leave now! Get out of there! Um, you hurt, if man? We can. We should have him regroup with us as soon as possible. Tell us what happened and where you are now. We'll come find you immediately. No. Your safety is the top priority. It seems this space can... Oh. Huh? He disappeared. Where'd he go? It sounded like he might be injured. We need to go help him. It seems the only option we have to explore any further is through that entrance over there. <laughs> He's injured and telling us to be careful? It's not like we're in any danger here. Anyway, the secret behind whatever's going on should be in this cave, right? Don't worry, little dude. Ito's on the way! Boss, please don't go charging ahead. You're an <laughs> Oni, not some hunting dog. Don't worry! She has a point. <laughs> oh! Looks pretty deep. Be careful, Man. Ito is literally making this um, quest more entertaining than it's supposed to. Oh, shoot. 
Well, that wasn't so bad. Apparently, we're using the Traveler again. And we currently glitched right there. Um, examine mysterious door in front of you. I promise I'll try not to laugh. What? What do you mean, try not to laugh? You should be feeling some serious sympathy for me right now. But wouldn't feeling sorry for you be a violation of your dignity? Besides, it's harder not to laugh when I'm not the one in pain. <laughs> oh. <laughs> really? <laughs> Okay. Apparently everyone is now laughing. Laugh at him, just let it out. Don't you have a heart, Shinobu? Oh, and people think I'm the monster. Wait a second. Show's not here, but Seems is that the door? Place here, don't you think? Maybe it's some sort of uh, I don't know, an emergency shelter. There was a picture book I read once that said nice people sometimes build cabins in dangerous places so that anyone in trouble can take shelter inside. Our little <laughs> dude must be inside then. Yeah. I wouldn't be too sure about that. Any person with a normal sense of danger wouldn't be so optimistic. Wow, bold chucker. Looks like your subordinate is telling you what's what. Oh, I believe she was talking to both of us. Yeah, so you can wipe that smug smile off your face. All right, watch and learn, Shinobu. This is why I'm the boss and you're the deputy. If no one is macho enough to open the door, then allow me. Step aside. Once this door's open, we are out of here. Oh, that was a strong kick. Or just press that. <laughs> oh man we are really making fun of Ito right here mm hmm this literally Evil looks like a you normal house me. get out of here uh am I seeing things or was there someone behind the door? Nah, can't be. You're just saying things. Why don't we just open the door again and see? Who? Uh, me? Oh, yeah. Uh, all right. Uh, I'll open it again. I think I'm starting to get the idea here. All you do is goof around all day. You're a bad influence to our child. Be gone. Um. <laughs> Those people are carrying bowls. Bowls full of beans. What's that all about? People throw beans to Probably an illusion. Is an Oni, so they throw beans at him to get rid of it. Probably whoever opens the door will currently um see their um nightmares probably. <laughs> Calm down now. You're a person from Inazuma too, you know. Hey, let's get one thing straight, all right? I'm not a person. I'm an Oni. Right, but that's not the point. The question is, does this door lead to Inazuma? Huh? How can that be possible? Ugh, this place is so weird. Open the you door again. Right ahead. I'm not opening it again. So, who's up? Oh, how about Paimon? Why don't you open it? No way! I'm telling you. <laughs> uh, it, whoever opens it is just right. will currently I'll just show an illusion of your nightmares, Shinobu. probably. Yeah. Whoever's behind that door push you around, okay? I'm already so right. sure about Let's that. Let's see what's behind the door this time. Oh wait, it's actually the same. I could be wrong. Oh wait, no! Same I was correct! Thing, Shinobu. <laughs> Listen, young lady. You should keep your nose out of those books and start taking my advice. I've already found you a perfectly good job as a shrine maiden at the Grand Narukami Shrine. You'll be far better off there than... 
Yep, I know it. Uh, Called it. Who? who is that? No way. Was that who I think it was? Oh, this is embarrassing. That voice was my mother. This is I know it. I wasn't counting on having it's an illusion. Speech again. Your mother wanted you to become a shrine maiden? The whole reason I came to study in Liyue was because I didn't want to become a shrine maiden. My family never approved of my studies, so they wanted me to work in the Grand Narukami Shrine after I returned to Inazuma. From what we know about Lady Guji, it seems being a shrine maiden is a pretty cushy job. Think of it this way. Some cats can be domesticated and kept in the house, while other cats are meant to survive in the wild. As for me, I need complete freedom and space. Although I do admit that being a shrine maiden is a decent job, it's just not for me. That's right, your calling is with the gang. I mean, just look at you. You rock, you're totally hardcore. Come on, am I the only one with chills right now? It's true, you've got a good thing going. What's most important is that you enjoy what you do. Gotta agree with you there. From the look of it, what's behind the door can change. And not only that, it always changes to something that nobody wants to see. So, uh, how are we gonna get through that? And don't forget, we have that little dude waiting for us to save him. We need to get our rear in gear. Would any of you like to give it a try? Come on, it's time for the no, traveler. Right. I'd prefer not to open it if only something terrible I want to awaits. open it. If anyone's going to find a way I'm already to curious what it's, it's going, going to show us. Uh, why? Because I don't buy it, that's why. I don't believe for one second that we're going to find the Conqueror of Demons by going through that door. So I'm sure as heck not going to be the one to get us through. Not going to lie, uh, you don't really sound like you have much of an imagination. All right. I'll try. Yeah. Okay. Savior. Show them what Looks like of. it's going to be unfair. I'm sure I probably do, but nothing springs to mind right now. Anyway, I suppose I'll find out once I open the door. Just an empty room. You old geezer. Out of eight pounds of salt, today you gave away three for free, sold two, and exchanged three for booze. How much money did you actually make in the end? Are these her huh? parents? But didn't you tell me to sell things as I pleased? Why can't I give the customers something for free? You fool! You told the old man next door to come and fetch the salt. Well, he broke his leg on the way over, and now his son is asking for compensation. Seriously. <sighs> <laughs> huh. A civil dispute. Didn't see that coming. Who are they? <sighs> no one in particular, but it is a prime example of the many difficult civil cases that I've had trouble handling before. Mm. So you mean you don't like handling disputes over petty matters? Not exactly. What I mean is that I don't like working with people who cannot let go of trivial grievances, especially of the kind you saw just now. They start with good intentions, but end up making a big fuss. It's not long before those good intentions plunge into injury and accidents. <sighs> it's always a shame. It's my desire to solve problems for people. That's why I became a legal advisor. It just seems that I still can't fully comprehend the complicated minds of some people. <sighs> I understand what you mean. The human mind is probably both the most complicated and tragic of things. I suppose there is no need to discuss this any further. Does anyone else want to try the door? Don't look at me. I told you, I'm not taking a chance with that thing. Come on, Yelan. We're a team here. So You're when is that traveler going to open the door, huh? Sing reason why. In that case, let me be perfectly clear. I serve Ningguang, the Tianxuan of the Qixing. The scope of my work includes some of Liyue's biggest secrets. The chances are, if I open this door, there can be no witnesses left alive. Is that a sufficient reason for you? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, sounds, sounds impressive. Um, hey, Shinobu, uh, who's Ningguang? She's someone who won't let you walk out of the chasm alive if she finds out that you're prying into her secrets. Boss, you really do need to work on learning <laughs> who's who in the world these days. Look, I knows what I needs to knows. It's called being a free Oni. Oh, now Paimon gets it. Galen works for Ningguang. 
<laughs> yes, which is precisely why I was trying to keep her secret. <laughs> we should avoid letting Yelan open this door. What about you, Traveler? Would you like to try? Finally, we yeah, finally get to open it. Traveler. Besides, you never know who could be behind that door. Maybe it could even be Shell. I say give it a shot. Who knows? Maybe little dude is waiting for us on the other side. Um, maybe I'm always looking for someone. What's this? So, wait. What's Paimon looking at? Abyss? Yo! The hell is this? Oh! Is this what I feared? The exit suddenly disappeared. Is it trying to trap me here? Escape? Huh. Oh! Man! Whoa! <laughs> Yo, that's so cool! find the person we want to rescue inside? Nope. Judging by the look on your face, I'm guessing you saw something a little unpleasant in there? Honestly, I didn't really saw anything else besides the um, abyss. Um, darkness of the uh, abyss that took my twin away. What? How could that be? Uh, don't worry. Paimon will keep searching for her with you. Cheer up! Uh, stupid door, I'll smash you to pieces! If Paima wasn't feeling so exhausted, she'd help out too. Uh, hey, what is this? Nap time? Uh, <sighs> so let me get this straight. Not only did we not find Xiao through that door, we saw all the things that we wish to avoid. I'm starting to have a very ominous feeling about this domain. It's constantly changing, and its changes seem to be targeted at us. What? What do you mean? I feel the same way. We need to watch our every step. There is definitely more to this place than meets the eye. I concur. We came here following the Conqueror of Demons, but we ended up only finding a strange door. The things we've encountered on the other side of that door are equally strange. It shows us whatever we fear the most. We're in a space that defies common logic. <sighs> on top of that, I'm starting to feel tired after that experience. But I thought we'd established that getting tired doesn't happen down here. The phenomenon hasn't reached a lethal stage just yet. Otherwise, we would have starved to death without eating for so long. I'm starting to worry that we're being affected by the changes in this space. In order to avoid the sudden accumulation of hunger and fatigue, we should eat and rest regularly from now on. <sighs> Paimon suddenly feels exhausted. It's really tiring going through all this. Now that you mention it, I'm starting to feel tired too. <laughs> No, 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 it's all just an illusion. I will not let my mind play tricks on me. Oh, Paimon's whole body just feels so heavy now. Hmm. According to the current evidence, it seems our physical condition was suspended in this space before, which granted us immunity to the effects of fatigue and hunger. And now it seems that mental fatigue is unavoidable. Though we have yet to locate the Conqueror of Demons, I suggest we go back and get some rest. It'll be difficult to rescue anyone if we're on the verge of collapse ourselves. She's right. Hey, Lavender Melon, you okay? Want me to carry you? Ah, <laughs> oh, man. Man, this is actually, um...
Very good. Apparently, we are back here. So, anyways, guys, um, I'm going to cut ahead on this um, video. Um, we have already been recording for more than an hour, so um, I'm guessing um, this will literally take longer than I thought. So, anyways, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. So, thank you very much, guys, for watching. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed. I will continue um, this quest on another video, which will be part two. This is apparently part one. So, yeah, uh, make sure to follow my Facebook page and also my Twitter account if you haven't already. Make sure to like this video and also please do leave a comment down there below if you have already played this um, quest. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.